To be in shape you don't need any advanced equipments or need to know any complex movements, some of the simplest exercises are also some of the most effective. Jumping jacks and jumping rope are ideal exercises to get your heart rate up, burn calories and help you stay in shape. Both exercises use your body weight as resistance and are aerobic in nature. You can include jumping jacks and jumping rope into your workout routine to supplement other exercises, or you can just perform them alone for an effective cardiovascular workout. But, if we talk about the effectiveness, is there one of them has an edge of advantage over other? And which one is better to include in your workout? Let's go through them one by one and find out. First let's look at the advantages of jumping rope. Jumping rope requires quick reflexes, coordination and good timing. The number of calories you burn will depend on your weight and the intensity of your skipping, but for an average sized person, this aerobic activity helps to burn approximately 10 calories in 1 minute. The exercise engages your entire body but mainly targets your calves and core muscles. Jumping rope also works on the forearm and shoulders muscles, as these muscles are used to hold and turning the rope. The quads muscles are also involved and your knees work as shock absorbers for each jump. While skipping rope, your aim should be to create a steady, uninterrupted rhythm of jumping for several minutes at a time. Now look at the advantages of jumping jacks. While performing jumping jacks, you raise your arms above your head and spread your legs outward, which engages your major muscle groups as well as your core. This helps to stabilize and balance your body. Jumping jacks require your entire body to move, which raise your heart rate in a relatively short amount of time. The pace at which you perform jumping jacks, determines the intensity of your workout. The faster you exercise, the higher will be the heart rate and increase in muscle engagement. Your rhythm is more important, your upper body should move in sync with your lower body and your breathing must be in tune with your movements. Conclusion both jumping jacks and jumping rope are exercises you can incorporate into aerobic or anaerobic workouts. While performing jumping rope you have to make coordination to continuously skip the rope, this is a great way to improve your focus, and also as you get advanced you can perform a number of different variations, which can help to develop different skills. On the other hand, when performing jumping jacks as you don't have to skip rope, so you can focus more on jumping and this can help to do the activity for longer period and burn more calories. Both exercises are beginners friendly, means you don't need to know any advanced skills to perform them. It also doesn't require a lot of space or fancy equipments to do them. These activities are ideal for warming up your muscles before engaging in more vigorous physical exercise such as sprinting, swimming, weightlifting or sports. Both the exercises make for a good complementary exercise that you can integrate into circuit training workouts. Both of these exercise helps to keep your heart rate elevated, which optimizes the circuit training objectives to increase muscle strength and develop cardiovascular endurance. So which of these exercises do you prefer more in your workout? Please share with us in the comments. If you find this video informative, give it a like and share with your friends. Subscribe the channel and turn on the notification bell so you never miss a new video. Thanks for watching.